we have some very dedicated and committed volunteer citizen scientists, they call us, um, who are trying to bring our native habitat back here, bringing this prairie and grassland back to its vibrant good health here. The reason it's called a grassland and not a prairie is because it consists of shrublands and wetlands and it has prairie, um, it has uh, savannas, beautiful baroque savannas. And in 2002, the Volunteer Corps began. Mm -hmm. And so we have had a lot of people who have come out. Some of them are out here all the time, like me. Um, we, you know, you can't get enough of it. Others come out because it's their favorite season. Important birds, though, are bobolinks, um, eastern meadowlarks, uh, the um, grasshopper sparrow, the field sparrow, um, let's see, who else do we have out here? Dick thistles um, are very important grassland birds. Uh, the habitat for these grassland birds just disappeared uh, quickly, very quickly. Um, so that we have these kinds of birds out here at Orland Grassland and nesting is just absolutely remarkable. Species. Little things we can do to remove invasives in the prairie grassland, restore some seed, and uh, bring the birds back and bring the butterflies back and you'd be surprised what you see that you never saw before. It's an awesome place. I love seeing it in pictures because we know what the, the neighboring uh, community looks like, but when you see a vista like that in a photograph, it takes you away from, from the congestion and the homes and the people of the area. And, and you can actually achieve that out and there's a lot of areas where if you're in the right little valley there, you don't hear anything, you don't see anything other than the nature that's out here. I think if each of us could give a couple hours a year, if you have time, uh, you know, it would help impact, make a tremendous impact to, uh, with, the, with the man hours to help out with, with the volunteer effort that's needed. Um, we've, we've also been involved with uh, another location down further south from here. It's around uh, uh, Route uh, 30 and I-57. Uh, kind of on the old plank trail area there. Uh, so there are other uh, grassland areas as well uh, throughout the uh, uh, Will and Cook County areas. Uh, it's, it's fun to do. You can uh, you get to know people that you didn't know before and uh, you're helping out the environment and it's, it's fun. Uh, for more information, go to our website at www.orlandgrassland.com Org, you're going to find out a lot about us. There's a contact us, which would be contacting me for more information. And there are so many beautiful pictures on there uh, just to help you relive and, and um, be able to educate yourself on what's out here. And we've only scratched the surface with those pictures, so there's a lot more to come from here.